Our only remaining mountain gorillas live in the De Democratic Republic of Congo in the Virunga National Park. In a documentary of the same name, the filmmakers show us with breathtaking images the heartbreaking, heartbreaking accounts of those who are trying to fight off poachers, armed militia, and a British oil company planning to drill in this protected space. It is powerful storytelling that puts environmental politics and greed front and center and in turn gives us a chance to save these magnificent creatures. Il y a seulement environ 800 qui restent sur toute l'étendue de la planète Terre. When they announced their intentions to explore for oil on Lake Edward, we informed them that it was not legal. A convoy of vehicles arrived and forced their way into the park. Unless they're shooting diamonds and fucking pissing iron ore, they don't give a fuck about that. Here to accept the Peabody is Orlando von Einseidel. Thank you. Thanks very much to the, to the Peabody Awards. Um, on behalf of the whole filmmaking team, our partners and our funders, we're really, really honoured to win this award. Um, with all that happened during the making of this film, for a long time we really couldn't even imagine finishing the film, let alone being at an award ceremony in, in New York. Um, making Vrunga was, was dangerous, difficult and often very scary for everyone involved, not least the rangers and the communities of the Vrunga National Park in eastern Congo, who were so generous in allowing us to share their story with the world. They're still putting their lives on the line each and every day. This project has always been about much more than the film to our team, because we believe that what's happening in Virunga has implications for all of us. We must protect the Virunga National Park, this jewel on our planet, and allow it to realize its potential of lifting hundreds of thousands of people out of poverty and fostering peace and stability in a region which has experienced 20 years of war. And we mustn't allow a United Nations designated World Heritage Site to fall victim to corporate interests like those of billion dollar oil company Soko International. Being recognised for the impact side of the film really means a huge amount to us and our hope is that this award continues to shine a spotlight on the battle going on in Virunga and the millions of people whose lives are being affected by it. Thanks so much to all of our partners funders and especially the team at Netflix for their fantastic and positive force behind this film and its goals. Thank you so much.